Welcome to this YouTube channel. In this video we are going to talk about top 10 shoes in the world. So before starting this video, please like this video, and subscribe to this channel for future updates. Number 10. Harry Winston Ruby Slippers, $3 million. These Ruby Slippers are designed by Harry Winston, and are a copy of Dorothy's Ruby Slippers from The Wizard of Oz. They are adorned with priceless jewelry and feature art that takes two months to create. On the 50th anniversary of the film's release in 1989, the pair of slippers are a nod to The Wizard of Oz. Ron Winston, the son of jewelry designer Harry Winston, decided to celebrate the 50th anniversary of the Hollywood, classic The Wizard of Oz in the most extravagant way possible. And he decided to do so by recreating Dorothy's ruby slippers. These shoes are the pinnacle of luxury, meticulously made with 4,600 rubies. These stunning shoes have 50 carats of diamonds in addition to 1,350 carats of rubies. These ruby slippers, which cost $3 million, much outshine the original, which were made of simple red sequins. Number 9. Stuart Weitzman Rita Hayworth Heels, $3 million. Rita Hayworth, one of the old Hollywood darlings earned a spot in fashion, the beautiful, subdued shade of sienna satin used in the design, of these heels is a refreshing change from all the glitz and glam typically seen in expensive footwear. The earrings are prominently displayed in the center of the shoes, elevating the whole ensemble to pure poetry. Despite its understated elegance, this pair features a satin ruffle, near the toe section with a variety of precious gemstones, including diamonds, sapphires, and rubies. These $3 million open-toed heels are the property of Hayworth's daughter Princess Yasmin Aga Khan. The Rita Hayworth heels are studded with diamonds, rubies, and sapphires and are Stuart Weitzman's most costly accessories. Number 8. Stuart Weitzman Cinderella Slippers, $2 million. These beautiful Stuart Weitzman slippers are made of Italian leather, and are another Stuart Weitzman creation. Cinderella, a well-known fairy tale heroine, served as inspiration. If that wasn't enough, the right shoe is home to a 5-carat amaretto, diamond, which is worth over a million dollars on its own. Alison Krauss, a country singer, wore the 4-inch stilettos to the 2004 Oscars, and they blended into the background allowing the audience to focus on the dazzling diamonds. The Cinderella slippers are made up of 565 Quiat diamonds set in platinum, at the laces and are another luxurious pair from Stuart Weitzman's expensive range. A pair of these shoes has a $2 million price tag. Number 7. Debbie Wingham Heels, $15.1 million. Debbie Wingham, who is no stranger to making luxury pieces, was commissioned to design this obscenely expensive pair as a birthday gift. The high heels are set with some of the world's most valuable and rare gemstones, such as blue and pink diamonds, which explains the exorbitant price. The shoe's shell is made of silver, while the plaque is made of pure gold. The rest of the shoes are made of leather, but they have 24 karat gold paint on them. This priceless pair was stitched with 18 karat gold. These shoes are the second most costly pair of footwear in the world, made by British designer Debbie Wingham. The designer partnered with Chris Campbell, a footwear designer to create these shoes for a private client as a gift for a family member's 30th birthday. The client's family collection of precious stones was used, and the whole process took over 100 hours. They have 3 carat pink diamonds on the front, and 1 carat blue diamonds on the back of each of them. Number 6. Jada Dubai and Passion Jewelers, Diamond Shoes, $23.6 million. Jada Dubai and Passion Jewelers have teamed up to produce, one of the most costly pairs of shoes ever created. The Stiletto Heel Shoes, which cost $17 million, are set with a pair of 15 carat D-grade diamonds. The trim is embellished with a total of 238 diamonds. The pair, which costs more than most mansions on the French Riviera, was on display at the Burj Al Arab in Dubai, alongside a less exotic red pair encrusted with rubies and costing just $27,000. It took nine months for expert shoemakers to create it out of pure gold. It is unknown if it was sold. Number 5. Tanzanite Heels, $2 million. These Stuart Weitzman stiletto heels, the third on this list, were the product of a partnership between Eddie Levian and Weitzman. These heels, which are valued at $2 million, are a sight to behold. The fact that these shoes are made of gleaming silver adds to their allure, giving them a delicate, ethereal appearance. 
A pair of tanzanite heels designed by Stuart Weitzman is encrusted, with 185 carats of elegant bright blue tanzanite gemstones, as well as a 28-carat tanzanite that adds to its charm. A pair of these beauties could set you back $2 million. Number 4. Nike Air Mag 2016, $26,000. If you like shoes, this is one shoe for which you might consider, taking out a second mortgage on your home. Back to the Future 2, a cult sci-fi film from the 1980s, inspired the 2016 version of the Air Mag. Although the auto-lacing feature and lights in that pair were accomplished by cinematic, effects, all of that technology has now become a reality 30 years later. These sneakers have a motor and are battery-powered. The brand only produced 100 of these, making them extremely rare. These shoes are currently on the market for $26,000 on average. Number 3. The Hermes Brickenstock Sandals, $34,000 to $76,000. Will you ever consider chopping up a Hermes bag? Most people would be offended by the mere suggestion, but Mischief, a Brooklyn group, was. It also combined the cork soles of German Birkenstock sandals with its own. Fashionistas have praised the unusual combination, and three pairs have already been published. This nefarious fashion label has previously combined t-shirts from 10 streetwear labels in a similar fashion. In high street fashion, Hermes Birkin bag is a must-have. At least two leather workshops turned down MSCHF's concept of chopping by a Birkin bag. Prices for the sandals range from $34,000 to $76,000. This would seem to be a deterrent to potential buyers. However, according to the company, they may only have four to six pairs left to sell. Number 2. Testoni Shoes minus $38,000. Men are notoriously inept when it comes to knowing what looks good on their feet, but even the most sartorially challenged individual must admit that these shoes are beautiful. And they should, given that each pair costs a whopping $38,000. If you're wondering how the brand explains its high price, it all comes down to the brand's revolutionary Norvegese technique. The leather used to make these shoes is the finest alligator leather available and is highly durable. Despite the fact that Testoni was established in 1929, the brand's craftsmanship is well ahead of its time. Another factor that contributes to the high price of these shoes is their exceptional water resistance, which is something that every man seeks in an ideal pair of leather shoes. Number 1. Nike So Carl Air Force One Supreme Max minus $50,000. The futuristic sounding Air Force One Supreme Max, one of the most costly Nike shoes, is next on the list from dependable, old Nike. Since their release, every dude has fantasized about owning a pair of these shoes. This pair goes a step further than the Air Force One range, which was a diamond-studded extravaganza. Furthermore, the company has improved the footwear's longevity this time around. The bright neon splashes on the body of these shoes might have been excessive, but they actually complement the overall sleek look. The upper portion of these shoes is made of luxury leather, while the bottom is made of 3M reflective material. The neon green laces add a cool pop of color to the shoe. What do you think of our list? Let us know in the comment section below. If you enjoyed this video and want more videos from us again, be sure to hit that subscribe button before you go.